everyone welcome back to my channel today we are going to be having a look at the brand new adopt me halloween update that has just released in the game halloween is one of my favorite times of the year and i always get so excited when the adopt me updates come out because they're just so fun and this update is going to consist of four weeks worth of content so this is halloween week one and it says we have five horrifying pets to adopt earn candy from two new mini games halloween furniture toys and vehicles are also a part of this update too and we also have the brand new lava dragon that looks like one of the new pets that looks really cool too so let's go ahead and jump straight into game and let's head to where this halloween update is being held i cannot wait for this i'm so excited the only thing i'm a little bit sad about is that they didn't bring the full map back with the halloween update i love when they bring that map out at the halloween time i just think it's it matches the vibes here we are we have a arrived it looks like we have found a spooky abandoned haunted house potentially and it's tucked away behind the shops which i like it's kind of like it's quite secret i'm going to be checking out the actual update on a private server but to play the mini games i'm going to hop in a public one because i want to experience it with other players and look at there's a boat going around the lake it's like an invisible ghost boat i guess you could call it that right this building is so cool i think this is one of the coolest ones they have done so far so let's head inside and see what the new items are like so let's go ahead and check out all these new items unfortunately i can't buy any yet because i'm gonna have to get some candy this is coming soon in six days so we can't get this yet so this is probably gonna be coming out next week it looks like all them items over there are also gonna be coming in 20 days they look like some more pets actually Ooh, okay maybe another unicorn pet that looks like a, a horse maybe and and I'm not sure what this one is, but them pets look really cool. I'm excited for them. And then it looks like we have this vehicle over here, which we can buy for candy. And that's 75,000 candy for the Shadow Rider. But that is a cool bike. I'm definitely going to be saving up for that. And then we have all the pet wear, of course. We have this ghost hat, which is adorable. We have this crescent moon head ornament, which is legendary for 10,000 candy. The spiderweb crown for 850. This hair clip, which is adorable, which is 2,500. The candy corn hat i love this and this is a common so this will be one of my first purchases for sure and that's 450 oh my gosh i am obsessed with this backpack for 4000 this is an ultra rare though and the bat backpack too that's so cute for 5000 and then we have these bat candy earrings they're so cute too luckily they are a common as well so i could buy them pretty soon so that is the pet wear that is a good selection some of my favorite selections so far actually looks like we have something else coming next way then we have a vampire teeth grappling hook this pumpkin basket which is one of my favorites too i cannot wait to get this we have the spiderweb flying disc this which is also coming in six days time the pet wear is there as well then we have this new vehicle which is so fun it is a throwing knife target which is fifteen thousand, and i did see in the trailer that you can actually ride it so i'm assuming it's going to be under vehicles but your character kind of lays on it like this and it spins around and and I just think that's awesome. And then we also have this, which is coming in six days time. And all this stuff over here, which is coming in six days time. 13 days time, sorry. Then we have some more stuff. Oh my gosh, what is this? This crystal ball stroller is amazing. I need that in my life. And this too, the potion bottle balloon. That's only 1,000. I really need that. I'm obsessed with that. And then we also have this skull propeller as well. The bat winged balloon, which I love that as well. And then we have this zombie finger rattle too. I have to get this. I love this so much. This is so cool. And last but not least for the items, we have the new pets, of course. And these five are only the beginning. We have so many more coming. So we have this one here, which looks like um, there's been a bit of a mistake because it's currently called UI.buy underscore label underscore item. <laughs> I don't think that's meant to be there. I think it's meant to say by the evil bas basilisk I think that's called that's a really cool Halloween pet and that one is for 60,000 these are all gonna be quite pricey but it's because usually the candy items are quite pricey but it's okay you know we, we could save up then we have the chimaria I think that is which it looks like it's a lion a snake 
and I don't know what that pet is. Maybe a goat? I'm not too sure. Then we have the Lava Dragon, which is Robux. It is a thousand Robux, so unfortunately you will not see me buying that anytime soon. If I did have the Robux, I would probably get this because it is really cool. Then we have the Slug for 9,000. The Slug is definitely my favourite of the first wave for sure. It's so cute. I can't tell if it's like cute or like a little bit creepy and like it's a slimy slug. It's like cute, gross gross at the same time you know what i mean and then we have the basilisk which is 25,000. these two are more on the cheaper side and these two are the more expensive ones but i'm definitely going to save up as much as i can i'm so excited to purchase all these new items i'm actually really impressed by this update so far and i cannot believe that we've got even more coming all these things that are shadowed right now we've got even more coming which is insane and this update is here for 27 days as well which is the whole month basically however the video does not stop here we've looked at the items but it's now a time to go ahead and try out these two new mini games so i want to play them in a public server you know get the full experience of playing it with other players so i'm gonna go ahead and jump into a public server and we can play these two mini games i'm very excited about these so i have gone ahead and jumped into a public server and i'm pretty sure this is a new one because everyone's just starting to come in now and there is six minutes until Till the next game I think this may be the Simon Says game and there's about 16 minutes till the other one so I think we have to go up here so I'm gonna go up here and see where this takes me but it's kind of like this glass bridge okay here we are so you can actually spectate the game now which is really cool this is a new feature that they've added in and it says don't believe the evil unicorns lies trust the chick Trice. I'm also wondering if these are two new pets. Is the evil unicorn making an appearance back? Because this also looks like a new pet too. So I'm going to go ahead and wait in the circle and I'm going to get in the queue for the Chicka Trice Says mini game and I'll be back with you when it begins. Okay, the mini game is now beginning and it looks like we've been teleported over here. I'm so confused. I don't understand. I don't understand what we're meant to be doing. There's two s pictures. I don't know what this means. Okay, well, I don't really know what happened there. <laughs> I don't understand what you're meant to do at all. I'm very confused. But I did get 900 candy for surviving one round, which is actually a lot more than the other previous updates before. Before, you'd only get about 200 candies for completing one mini game. So that's pretty good, I guess. But I'm going to go ahead and try and watch. I think there's like one person remaining. Does that mean you have to go? This looks like the autumn part. So does that mean you have to go over there? Okay, it does. Okay, that makes sense. So so even now you have to go to the snowy realm or I'm not quite sure what that one is. But then ones will stand up and you have to go to them before the time runs out. Okay, I understand. I understand that now. I was so confused at first. I did not know what was going on. But basically for that mini game, it looks like the parrot or something will go in the middle. It will say what realms to go to or what stations to go to. And you have to go to that before the time runs out. Okay, that makes more sense now. Unfortunately, I did die pretty early in that mini game but i just have to keep playing it and get used to it a little bit more i would love to give it another go in this video but i would have to wait another 17 minutes which is quite a long time and i want to get this video up for you guys as soon as possible but i'll be playing that mini game in another video so look out for that because i do have more halloween videos planned but the next game is in seven minutes and this is kind of like a tile run one and it reminds me of fool guys a little bit if you've played that game so i'm going to go ahead and wait in the queue for that so i'm gonna wait over here i've only got six minutes to wait so not too long and it looks like we're probably gonna be teleported out there i think i'm gonna do a lot better on this one this one's a lot easier there is so many people here <laughs> so the second mini game is now beginning and i'm really excited for this so you basically have to not fall through the tiles and i reckon i am gonna do okay at this one you know i don't think i'm gonna do too bad at this one let's hope and i'm quite intrigued to see how many candies i'm gonna get from this one that's if i can actually stay up and not fall down i've just fallen down two levels so um yeah i'm gonna have to try and stay up okay oh no oh no oh no i don't think i'm gonna make it i died but look how many candies we're getting oh i managed to get 
3,954 candies from that. That's crazy. I've already got 4,000 candies. Is this like a bug or something? Or are they actually just being really generous with the amount of candies they're giving us? Maybe this year they've decided to be quite generous because usually before we'd only get about 200 candies. But I just got nearly 4,000 from that mini game and I died halfway through too. So that is everything new to check out with the brand new Halloween update. I am so impressed by this update. I cannot wait to play it and I'm so excited for all of the other stuff to come out in the game too. I cannot believe that this is just wave one and we've got more waves coming. I think there's four. Four waves worth of coming because there's four weeks in October which is just crazy. They are being so generous with their candy as well in the new mini games which are also so good and I just cannot wait to get all the items. I'm so excited and this is going to be a big update. I can feel it. But let me know what what is your favourite item with the new Halloween update? My favourite is definitely this stroller and this balloon. I cannot wait to get my hands on it and I can actually already buy it because I already have enough candy which I just wasn't expecting to end the video with this much candy. I have so many more videos planned on this update that I cannot wait to share with you so I hope you are looking forward to them too but that's where I'm going to leave today's video here. I hope you did enjoy. I hope that you have a great rest of your day and I will see you again very very soon. Bye!